we want to compute the first three terms up to the second degree of the Taylor expansion of e to the power of ta, where a is the two by two matrix with entries two, three, two, two. We're asked to write the result as a single matrix and then use it to approximate e to the power of 0.1a. Using the definition of the matrix exponential e to the power of a, e to the power of ta is equal to i plus ta plus one half times the square of ta and so on. This is an infinite series, however, we're told to only use the first three terms or up to the second degree, and therefore we stop here. Next, we substitute matrix A into the equation. Also notice one half times the square of TA results in T squared divided by two times the square of matrix A. Next, we square matrix A. Squaring matrix A results in the two by two matrix with entries 10, 12, eight, and 10. Next, we perform scalar multiplication with t and t squared divided by two. And then finally, we add the three matrices. E to the power of ta is approximately equal to the two by two matrix where in the first row, the entries are one plus two t plus five t squared and three t plus six t squared. And the entries in row two are two t plus four t squared and one plus two t plus five t squared. This is our approximation for the matrix exponential e to the power of ta. And now we use this to approximate e to the power of 0.1a by substituting 0.1 for t and simplifying. e to the power of 0.1a is approximately equal to the two by two matrix where the entries in row one are 1.25 and 0.36 and the entries in row two are 0.24 and 1.25. I hope you found this helpful.